We've seen plenty of guys make light of bad situations, but this burglary victim might just take the trophy. It's not quite the crime of the century. There was this woman at my door. The video camera system sends me a screenshot. Perhaps a neighbor saying hi on Heather Bray Drive in Arcadia. But then this. She runs off into the distance in this weird kind of like, I don't know, like she's almost got a flat tire and is scurrying off in there. And in her hand, Tim Lake's Amazon delivery. You always see victims on TV, but you never think you're going to be one. So Tim began plastering this very tongue-in-cheek poster around his neighborhood. It won't happen again, not as long as we're getting the word out. Detailing what happened. On Friday, the second day of August, in the year of our Lord, 2013, I was suddenly and deliberately, deliberately robbed by an unknown assailant. I'm sorry. And also describing the suspect. Well, at first we thought it was Dog the Bounty Hunter, and he had just let himself go. Eyes. Vacant, uncaring, lacking a soul, height, about yay. He even set up an email, Heather Bray Drive Justice at AOL.com, for tips leading to the capture. And I think AOL is still cool. So far, three emails, one's from the AOL team and two are from the same guy. Nothing. But there is some consolation. Inside that Amazon delivery, just some K cup coffee pods and an ice tray. Ice trays that make perfectly square ice cubes for like cocktails or even, now that I think about it, iced coffee. I could have made iced coffee with those things. Tim though says he'll continue to search for this thief. I'm not gonna be a victim. And though he doesn't expect an arrest, he hopes she's watching and listening to this message. I don't know who you are. I, I don't, don't know what, what you want. want, but I will look for you. I will find you and I will convict you. So that's the gist of what I'd say to her on the street if I ran into her. In Phoenix, Greg Argos, CBS 5 News.